Hi everyone and welcome to the final morning report chart appraisal for today, Thursday the 31st of July with me Richard Perry, Market Analyst at Hantech Markets and as ever it's gold is the final chart of the day. Now what are we looking at on gold? Well it is starting to to trade below this 144 day moving average which is becoming um, a bit of a concern of mine. Um, I had been hoping that uh, 144 day moving average was going to be the basis of support um, within the prospect of a, of a medium to longer term recovery in gold but it's just it is breaking down and putting a load of pressure on this 1290 level 1291.70 but then that was breached intraday 1287.50 and it just looks like 1290 is a bit of a support but then 1280 is probably then when we start to get the real support coming in um, and in the morning report I started to lay down um, the uh, the prospect of, um, a, an, uh, of a breakdown in gold and what, what would be uh, the next levels that we need to be watching 1260 certainly seems to be one of them 1259 uh, if you want to be exact but 1260 there or thereabouts and then 1240 uh, is uh, again a bit of a level where you need to be watching out for if that 1280 level were to be breached on the downside the pressure is growing that's uh, that's undoubted um, if you look at these momentum indicators they are st I mean, the RSI is still holding on to a, a slightly positive outlook uh, finding support around those low 40s and it's still up at 44 so you would argue that's still slightly in positive configuration MACD lines have just unwound to neutral but as I said now beginning to put pressure on that outlook and the stochastics also not looking all that positive so the this 1290 support is a is a key level I think and then 1280 is the really important support um, and it looks like that pressure is growing on the downside if you look at this 21 day moving average which is rolled over provided a bit of resistance in the last few days uh, as well that uh, is currently around 1310 but I think certainly if you look at the intraday chart you'll get a gauge that um, the pressure is uh, on the downside with these sequence of lower lows um, in terms of resistance you'd be talking about the uh, reaction high at 1302.40 and then 1312.10 uh, being the uh, major uh, near-term levels to watch out for but certainly I think the pressure is growing to the downside which it, for me is disappointing because I was thinking that this was going to start to develop more of a longer um, term bit of support but uh, that support is coming under consistent threat at the moment so uh, we'll see how this goes but at the moment uh, this dollar strength that we've seen in the last couple of weeks is, is beginning to now show on gold so I wish you good luck in your trading today and I will speak to you tomorrow thank you